to our family first segment on this Monday. A lot of folks avoiding the doctor's office during the pandemic, putting off things like visits to the eye doctor. But as Leah Lando reports, if you haven't had an eye exam in a while, doctors say now is the time to schedule one. The eye really is the window to one's soul, um, and you it's the one place in the entire body where you can view live blood vessels. Dr. Kimberly Rosati says you can tell a lot about a person's health through their eyes. An eye exam can detect diabetes, high blood pressure, elevated cholesterol, and sometimes even more serious diseases like cancer. During this pandemic, a lot of us have been staring at screens a whole lot more, and we're noticing changes in our eyesight. What can be done to improve that? Looking at computer screens all day can put a strain on the eyes, resulting in a wide array of symptoms like headaches, blurred vision, double vision, dry eye syndrome. She recommends taking frequent breaks and talking to your doctor about computer glasses. You can can be prescribed computer glasses with a non glare coating and a blue light blocking lens that can cut down on blue light emissions. Is there anything you can do in your daily life, like when it comes to diet or any sort of exercises to improve your eyesight? So, diet, we do know there is a correlation to diet and um, age related macular degeneration. You know, I tell a lot of my patients anything with green pigment is is very good for the eye. It has a lot of antioxidants, which can protect the macula. She also recommends wearing sunglasses to block UV rays and help prevent cataracts. And most importantly, visit the eye doctor. Leah Lando reporting there. Wednesday in our Family First segment, we'll talk to Dr. Rosati about a growing eye problem among children and what parents can do about that. For more, head to rochesterfirst.com.